After so many years of preparing for the sacred journey, I can't believe we're finally here. Let's check the time. <laughs> 8.55 a.m., July 27th, 2057. So noted. After driving all the way from Great Neck without stopping, I'm so excited to be here, I could just flex. Do you have the map of the Boulder attractions? Not sure we're in the right place. Yeah, we might have gotten a little bit lost off the Highway 36, but I'm pretty sure this is it. Welcome to the Reb Zaman Legacy Museum, a <laughs> celestial experience. <laughs> celestial seasonings, that's where we want to be. <laughs> I'm so excited, I can't wait. I hear the mint room is really cool. <laughs> Excuse me, you must be mistaken. This is not celestial seasonings. This is a museum in honor of the great rabbi, Solomon Shachter Shalomi. I studied all about Reb Zalman all through Hebrew school. He was my hero. Yeah, yeah, and I went to the Zalman Shachter Shalomi day school. <laughs> <laughs> I know everything about him. I guess we can do this museum first, then go to Celestial Seasonings afterwards. <laughs> yeah, hopefully it won't be too boring. Okay, listen up, listen up, everybody. We have three tours waiting to get in after you, so we must start your group immediately. <laughs> Throughout the years, many myths have arisen around the great Gadol Hador Red Zaman. On this tour, we'll be dispelling these myths and revealing the truth about the amazing life and times of this one-of-a-kind Rebbe. Through the technology of holographic representation, registered trademark, you will be able to witness important moments in this great rabbi's life. Prepare and purify yourselves as we ritually deploy you into the life of Reb Zaman. <laughs> we begin our tour at the beginning of Red Zaman's life, when he was just a baby. Amazingly, his very first words were, Paradigm shift. <laughs> True. And this is particularly remarkable when you consider that the words were in English and he was living in Poland. <laughs> Zalman's early childhood is shrouded in mystery. However, we do know something about his bar mitzvah, which took place in Vaslau, Austria, where young Zalman was taken by his parents, Chaya Gittel and Shlomo Hakohen. Reb Zalman has publicly described his bar mitzvah as very ordinary, but that is because he hasn't shared the real story. We will present that now through holographic representation. But Mr. Trademark. <laughs> Read this. <laughs> Today is my bar mitzvah. This is a very special occasion. I follow in the footsteps of my father and my father's father and my father's father's father and <laughs> <laughs> Young Zalman, you have been chosen to come to our planet. <laughs> That's 
to Earth? <laughs> changing event for young Zaman. And as part of our museum exhibit, we have a photo of a chopped liver display that mysteriously <laughs> appeared at the reception. As the winds of war intensified in Europe, 
The years following were a period of upheaval, turmoil, and general all-around sorrows for young Solomon. And we want you to experience it firsthand. <laughs> Solomon and his family were forced to flee from Poland to Vienna. Go! <laughs> Get too comfortable. Then it was off to Cologne. <laughs> and no sooner were you there than it's off to Antwerp. <laughs> and the next destination is France. <laughs> and now for the greatest journey of them all. Please get on the boat. <laughs> Next stop, Brooklyn. Arriving in New York, Reb Zalman met his lifelong friend, the late Shlomo Karlbach, which is also how he was known when he was alive, because he was never on time. <laughs> Solomon studied at the Lubavitcher Yeshiva and became a disciple of the great Rebbe Yosef Yitzhak Schneerson, leader of the Chabad movement. There he received his rabbinic ordination. <laughs> Of all my students, Zalman and Shlomo are my most beloved. Such minds, such dvekut, such holiness. But this music thing they do is driving me miss sugar. Like setting the morning's cottage to Home on the range. <laughs> or even vice, setting the holy Kol Nidre to You Are My Sunshine. <laughs> I can't take it anymore. <laughs> Salmon, Shloimi, come here. You can't hold it yet. Up, 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 up. Shalom Aleichem Zalman. No, where's that late Shlomo Kalba? <laughs> oh, holy teacher, Manish. You're the, the highest of the high, the, the sweetest of the sweet. Okay, okay, enough already, enough, enough. Okay. So, my holy Talmidim, we have a big problem. The hidden out there. They don't, darling. <gasps> they eat trap. <laughs> they, they don't know from a locker. It's a shanda, mamish. <laughs> a shanda. We gotta do something about it. So, so, I have decided to send the two of you. Away from Brooklyn to find these lost Yidden, find these lost Jews, and bring them back. Away from Brooklyn? You mean, oh, uh, Mamish, to the Bronx? <laughs> no, far 